In this tutorial, we'll see how to use debugger strategy in Ansible. This helps to analyze and fix errors during the execution of the task. For example, if you're getting an error in a task and if you want to test that particular task with different variables, you don't have to stop the execution and rerun complete job. In between, you can try that particular task with different variables. That is the advantage of using debugger and we have multiple options available we can set that in the playbook level or in the task level and you can give always never on failed if the task is failed it will trigger the debug option and if post is unreachable or if that particular task is skipped in all these cases also you can trigger debug and here we can see one task level example so we'll start writing the playbook here I'll be using this particular playbook for the debugger demo here. I have already added strategy debug and I'm printing inventory host name for the host demo 01. First I'll try running this playbook. 03. And now this is running successfully. And if I try giving an invalid variable, let me try running. Now this is getting into the debug mode and if you want to see the options we can give question mark here I have enabled this in the playbook level so here either we can give continue print hit or redo so let us try giving continue so now this has completely failed the task now we'll try running again question mark and I'll give P here so we are able to see a message saying that syntax error now if I try giving R so this is again trying to run the same task if I give R again it will be keep on trying same task now if you want to print the particular task arguments we can give P space task dot Args. So this is the argument which we are passing. And if you want to see the variables, you can give print task underscore wars. And this will be printing complete variables available within this task. Now, if you want to see the host details, we can give host. And here this is running against demo 01 now if you want to change a particular arg for example here we have seen this is the argument which we are using now if you want to change it we can give task here we don't have to give p here we are going to set the value in the runtime args then i'll change the message to there and let me just so now if you want to run it I'll give R again so now this is successful so I have just changed this to a string instead of this invalid variable now let us try running this again now here we have another option result enter so here this will be printing the result object now we can even give result underscore result so here you will be able to see the complete task result now we'll see how to set this in the task level here the logic is going to be easy i'll give debugger on field previously we have seen the options here save it and let us try running again so now also this is getting into the debugger mode and here now instead of 
this variable will try to change the variable to inventory host name previously we have seen how to change the argument using task.args now here we will try to set a value for this variable currently we can see this particular variable is undefined to set the variable we can use task underscore wars then the variable name is inventory post name one equal to i'll just call this some variable enter and i'll give r again so now this is considering this value as a variable and if you want to update the argument we have seen earlier i'll run it again and here i'll give task dot args then within message i'll give valid variable name this inventory underscore host name enter and we'll try running again so this time this has printed the actual inventory host name so within debugger we have changed this particular argument and we have seen how to even set a variable within debugger these are some of the options available in debugger and this will help you to fix errors during the execution of the task without rerunning the complete playbook